Hi violinists, I'm Julia, I'm an online violin teacher and today I will teach you how to play He's a Pirate. Um, it's the song, the theme song from Pirates of the Caribbean, but probably everybody will recognize this song. I will come really close to the camera and show you what you have to do. The song starts on the first finger on the D string. And oh, I forgot one little thing. Make sure to download my sheet music for my website because it will be much easier to learn this song. You don't have to watch the whole YouTube video if you don't want to. You can also just download the sheet music. And there I put down all the finger numbers. I put down the strings you have to play on and also the notes. So even if you can't read notes, it could probably be really helpful for you. But you can of course also watch the whole video or you can do both of it. Just see whatever you like. And right now we will start with our first finger on the D string and the song starts like this. I decided to add this little intro to the song. And actually it's just one finger but it's quite hard to get the rhythm. So try to get the rhythm and if you really don't get the rhythm you can also just start uh, from this point onwards. And the song will start like... And of course you will play it probably faster and with more attack, but I will play it really quick, uh, slowly so everybody can see it. But you can also play it like... Um, I think this song sounds quite cool if you play it with a lot of attack and a lot of volume and like BAM! Because I think the song is like this. But I will play it really slowly. This song sounds really cool and it also sounds really cool if you play it quicker but even the slow version is quite awesome and isn't even that hard. So I think it's a fun song to start learning quite quickly in your violin journey. And if you are looking for other tutorials on how to play things on violin, film music, pop music or folk music or improvising on the violin, make sure to check out my channel because I upload way more videos than just this one and I would really like you to support me and subscribe because I really do this for you. I do this for violinists that are actually looking for tutorials on YouTube that maybe don't have the money to pay a violin teacher. Maybe they are living far away and they have no violin teacher around. And I really want to support you. So uh, let me know if this, uh, if this really helps you. I really get supported with that as well. And I get motivated to continue doing this. Yeah, that was everything I wanted to say for today. I hope to see you next week for next tutorial. Goodbye and enjoy playing the violin. <laughs>